Hello and welcome back to my channel. In this tutorial, we are going to learn how to declare, implement and use an interface in Go. In Go, an interface is a set of method signatures. An interface specifies what methods a type should have, but does not provide an implementation for those methods. Interface provides a way to achieve polymorphism in Go. To declare an interface in Go, use the type keyword followed by the interface name and the list of method signatures. Here is an example. Type shape interface with two methods, area and perimeter. This interface name shape requires that any type implementing it must have two methods, area and perimeter, both of which return a float 64. To implement an interface, you simply need to define the methods specified by the interface. Here is an example. In this code, we define the rectangle struct with two fields, width and height. It's then defined the area and perimeter methods for the rectangle type. Since these methods have the same names and signatures as those specified by the shape interface, the rectangle type satisfies the shape interface, meaning the rectangle type implement the shape interface. Once you define an interface and implement it for one or more types, you can use the interface to achieve polymorphism. Here is an example. In the code, we define the function print shape info that takes a parameter of type shape. When called, it prints the area and perimeter of the shape using the area and perimeter methods defined by the shape interface. In the main function, we create a rectangle interface and pass it to the print shape info method. Since rectangle satisfies the shape interface, meaning since the rectangle implement the shape interface, this works correctly. Let's try. Open the terminal and type go run interface.go. Perfect. We have the value of the area and the value of the perimeter. In summary, interface in Go provides a way to define a set of method signatures that any type can implement. This allows for polymorphism and makes it easier to write code that works with different types. By following the step that we saw in the tutorial, you can declare, implement and use interface in your programs. Thanks for watching this video, subscribe to my channel to be always updated about a new video that I will upload and see you in the next video tutorial, bye.